looking to get into late position, okay, with Anthony and Taya, okay? Now, if you are first to enter the pot and you are in late position, okay, that's a time when you can steal, when you can make a steal attempt at a pot, whether you're playing in limit, no limit, or you're playing in a tournament, okay? If you are first to enter the pot and you are in a late position, you can raise with almost any two cards. The cards are almost non-existent. It doesn't matter what your cards are when you're in a late position if you're first to enter. So for example, this person is first to act, he folds. This person folds, this person folds. Now Anthony is in a late position, okay? So for example, if Anthony were to have a hand such as a jack eight, whether it's suited or not, he does have a chance to make a straight. He could play a suited connector from that position. And what is recommended if you're gonna play from that late position and you're first to enter the pot, you really wanna bring it in with a raise. Because again, when you raise, you are representing that you have a very strong hand, okay? So now, Anthony's first to act, he's in late position, and he brings it in with a raise, okay? Now, Taya is on the dealer button. Now, because Anthony raised, Taya must take into consideration, again, the gap concept. Because the pot was raised, you must think, I must have a very strong hand in order to enter the pot. There is